Hi everyone, welcome to yet another video for Philip Seiko on DDS CAD. Well, receiving DWG drafting is a real demand in the AEC industry. In this video, I will show you how you can easily prepare your DWG to be used as an XREF. Before viewing the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to hit the bell to be notified of the new videos. Enjoy! So, to import the DWG inside DDS CAD, I will come to the function Import Model Manager. In the tab Imported Files, I click on the New button and I will select the DWG file I would like to open. So, double click this one. Before I insert the DWG in DDS CAD, I will select this option Open New Window. And, like in this case, uh, Instead of opening the DWG in DDS CAD model, I'm opening the DWG editor because here I can individually select the DWG elements and I could remove it. So I could instantly remove the title field. What else I could do here? I could like make a zoom window and just show in the interface what I would like to, to import in DDS CAD. And with a function called select all objects completely outside current zoom window, um, if I zoom out now, all the elements that were not in that uh, zoom extension uh, are now selected. And I can also press delete and remove these elements. Um, else, what I can do here in this DWG editor is to change the DWG Origo, because sometimes the model that you would like to, to use as an XREF is just far away from your Origo. So with this function called pick a new Origo for the drawing, we just click here and select what we would like to use as the new Origo. So if I would like to use this corner as the new Origo, just click here. I won't change anything in this dialog, I just press OK. And this already became the new origo for the drawing. So uh, now I can just save this, um, the DWG here, because I will further uh, clean this DWG in the DDS CAD model itself. So I come to apply DWG DXF chains, and I have some options of saving, but I will select this last one in which, in which I can save with another name. Okay, in DDS CAD now, um, we have imported the, the last changed or the updated DWG. To further clean this DWG, I will use the function layer wizard. With the layer wizard function activated, we move our cursor to the layers we would like to hide in the model. So I left click and we can remove it from the model. What else we can do and we should do is to check the scaling of the model. So we can check in no length using the function measure between two points. For instance, I will check the length of this door opening. Uh, as we can see here, we have uh, 0.91 meters, which is a pretty decent uh, length for a door opening, but let's just pretend that this is this um, uh, length were not correct. We would come to the tab scale, and in this field for real world length, we could set another length, for instance, one meter. If I just press tab, the scale multiplier and scale ratio is just updated, and if we would like to to update the model with this new scale, we just click on a set scale, which is not the case here. So press cancel. I individually like to, to, to have the DWG uh, XREF with a neutral color. To do so, we come to the layer display. We see here the layers that I have hide it. They are turned off in a column on and in the type, we'll just come to this DWG type. 
And if I would like to change the, the pen color, first I would select all the layers that I would like to change the color. So they would be highlighted and I would click on the layer pen column. So this would be turned on. And on a pen uh, def, we can select a pen color. So as is already selected the dark gray, I would click OK. And if we click repaint, we would see in the background the, the new color. And just so that we do, do not have to edit this all over the time, we can create a layer setup. And I press save. And this will be stored in the layer setup drop down list. Now my DWG is ready to be used as an XREF. If you like this video, share with your colleagues. If you have any questions or suggestions, put your comment below and we'll get back to you. Cheers!